Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat, and his black and white cat. Early in the morning, just as day is dawning, he picks up all the post bags in his van. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat, and his black and white cat. All the birds are singing, and the day is just beginning. Pat thinks he's a really happy man. Everybody knows his bright red van. All his friends will smile as he waves to greet them. Maybe you can never be sure they'll be knocking ring letters through your door. <laughs> postman Pat, postman Pat, postman Pat, and his black and white cat. He's a really happy man. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Hey, look at the time. I'm going to be late for work. And Julian's going to be late for. Come on, Dad. I'm going to be late for school. Okay, Julian. Don't worry. I'm on my way. <laughs> See you both later. Bye. Bye, love. Meow. Hold it. What's the trouble, Arthur? There's no trouble, Pat. That's the trouble. What do you mean, Arthur? Well, I've got nothing to do. No one really needs my help anymore. That's why I've asked for a new job with the Pinkaster Police. What? <laughs> You mean you're leaving? Yes, I'm expecting a phone call from the Pinkaster police station to say everything's going ahead. Meow. Anyway, call standard chat. I'm sure you're busy. Come on now, move along, move along. I can't imagine Greendale without PC Selby. And what about Lucy? If her dad goes, she'll leave too. What if we give him a big party? Then he'd see how much everyone needs him. That's a good idea, Julian. I'll tell everyone on my rounds and ask them to meet at the Green this afternoon for a big PC Selby party. Might as well go back to the car. Maybe someone will have an emergency to report. met PC Selby this morning and he's leaving Greendale to work in Pencaster. Oh, no. no! Lucy, is this true? I wasn't supposed to say anything. Don't worry. My dad's going to have a big party for your dad on the green after school so everyone can tell him how much we want him to stay. Mr Pringle, can we write a song to sing for PC Selby? Well, I think that's a great idea, Julian. Yes! Brilliant! Oh! You all right, Ted? Eh? Oh, sorry, Pat. Just mending Dr Gilbertson's car. Morning, Pat. Hello, Ajay. I'm glad you're both here. I need to talk to you about PC Selby. Eh? I think he's leaving Greendale. Oh! <sighs> no emergency calls, no nothing. It'll be different in Pencaster. Robbers to chase, crimes to solve. <sighs> a party for PC Selby? That's a grand idea, Pat. We could do with his help on Dr Gilbertson's car. Why don't you give him a call, Ted? I know he's not busy. I will. At least we need him, eh, Pat? <laughs> <laughs> right then, children. We'll all listen to the songs and decide which one's best for PC Selby. Katie, Sarah, 
This is a song for PC Selby. What we really, really want. 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 Policeman! Yeah! That was a... Uh, well, that was very interesting. Now then, who's next? <sighs> oh, hey, uh, uh, what's that? Hello? Calling PC Selby. Calling PC Selby. Assistance required at Ted Glenn's Watermill. Over. Yes, of course. I'll be right over. Dear, we can't let PC Selby leave. I'll get me sheep up to the top field and then I'll come into Greendale and help with the party. Thanks, Alf. See you later then. <laughs> Bye, Pat. A party is a lovely idea, Pat. We'll make some food and take it over to the green. Thanks, love. Thanks, Nisha. Bye. Good idea, Pat. See you there. See you later, Reverend. Move, move! Arthur, thank goodness you came along. I can't get me sheep into this field. Don't worry, Elf. I'll give you a hand. Oi! Come back here, you silly sheep. Oof. Sir, we haven't really got any words yet. Never mind, boys. It was a good effort. Has anyone else got a song to sing? Well, Jess, now everyone knows about PC Selby's party. Meow. I hope we can convince him to stay in Greendale. Meow. Thanks, Arthur. I don't know what I'd have done without you. <coughs> well, uh, all in a day's work, Elf. Now then, if you'll excuse me. Bye. You're always on your way. Stay with us. We really need you here. What would Greendale be without you near? Hooray! Well, I think we've found our song. Don't you, everyone? Yeah! Wow. Great! Right, Pumpkin. That's you all groomed for the day. Mm. Ouch! Ow! Oh, ouch. Oh, oh, dear. I think I'd better call Dr Gilbertson. Hello? Oh, hello, Amy. What? I'll be there as soon as I... Oh, dear, I just remembered I haven't got my car today. I know... I'll call PC Selby. This is an emergency. Calling PC Selby. Calling PC Selby. Dr Gilbertson requires emergency help. Over. PC Selby here. I'm on my way. <laughs> oh, right. Hello, love. What time is PC Selby getting here? Oh, no. I was so busy telling everyone else about the party that I forgot to tell him. Oh, Pat. Don't worry. He'll be at Ted's, I hope. Oh, thank you so much, Arthur. I don't know what we'd do without you. Oh, well, <laughs> all in a day's work, Sylvia. There, nothing broken. You should be back to normal in a few days. Thanks, Doctor. And thank you, PC Selby. 
What would we have done without you? Um... <clears throat> Fancy forgetting to invite PC Selby to his own party, Jess. Meow. <sighs> Was that him? Meow. Come on. Meow. What would Greendale be without you, Mia? It does need something at the end to finish it off. I know, I know. Sarah. Can you still do that funny deep voice? What, this? Please don't go. <laughs> hey, come on, everyone. We'd better get to the green or we'll be late. Thanks again, Arthur. I hope Ted mends my car soon. Ted? I promised to help him mend your car this morning. I completely forgot. Not again, Jess. Meow. Where's he off to now? <laughs> Arthur. Hello, Pat. Uh, sorry I'm late, Ted. I've been rather busy today. How can I be of service? Well, she just needs a clean and we're finished. Right you are. Come on, Pat. What? Uh, uh, oh, OK. <laughs> Right, let's start her up. Oh, no! Perhaps this needs a bit of detective work. Hello, what's this? Oh! A bird's nest? That's the last place we'd have looked out there. Thank goodness you were here. <laughs> Well, <laughs> yes, well. Actually, Arthur, I could do with your help down at the green. The green? Right you are, Pat. Let's go. <laughs> What's all this, then? Surprise! What's going on? Well, Arthur, we just want you to know how much you mean to us and how much we all need you. Well, I, uh, I suppose there have been quite a lot of people to help today. <sighs> but I'm waiting for the call right now about my new job in Pencaster. Oh, no! Why don't you sing PC Selby your song, children? One, two, three! Please don't go, we need you every day. If there's trouble, you're always on your way. Stay with us, we really need you here. What would Greendale be without you near? Please don't go. <laughs> well, Arthur, will you stay and be our policeman? Hello? This is BC Selby. <gasps> Well, that's good news. I'm very happy to have been offered the job. <laughs> but I'm afraid I won't be able to take the job at Pencaster Police Station. I'm needed too much here in Green Bay. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> thanks, Dad. No, thank you, Lucy. And thank you too, Pat. It's good to be needed, but it's even more important to have friends.